Shalom Chevre, this is Richard Solomon, and this will be a brief demonstration on how you use Tag Galaxy. Tag Galaxy is a web tool that enables its users, such as Judaic educators and students, to search and organize their pictures that are on Flickr and make those pictures into web-based Judaic knowledge products, such as picture albums, collages, and multimedia presentations. Here is an example of a set of pictures of Israel that I was able to obtain through using Tag Galaxy. Let's first demonstrate these pictures. They are pictures of Israel in particular. I have a picture of the Kotel with some daveners. We have an aerial view of the Kotel. And we also have a lovely silhouette picture of a observant Jew walking. So the question is, how do you obtain these pictures on Flickr through using Tag Galaxy? Well, the first thing I need to say is for you to obtain a Flickr account. You do this by signing up at Flickr.com and you can then upload and pictures from your computer and uh, discover pictures that other people have uploaded onto their Flickr accounts and you can also share your photos on Flickr as well. So let's so show you how we were able uh, to accomplish this tag galaxy gallery of pictures. We're assuming that you already have a Flickr account. And let's take a look at what Tag Galaxy looks like. So here is my website of, uh, well, the website of Tag Galaxy. And all you have to do is place in this Tag search engine box some words. So let's say I were to write Israel and then hit go and what you will notice is a galaxy of planets shall we say of pictures will be on your computer screen so this is Israel here's one for Palestine here are a set of pictures for Jerusalem the Gaza etc now, the pictures on Jerusalem are 1,472,648 photos, which would be quite a bit to look at. If you just want to look at Palestine, you would have 101, uh, 999 pictures. So let's go to Jerusalem for a moment and take a look at some of the pictures of Jerusalem. Jerusalem is also subdivided into a number of subcategories. So you can go to the Western Wall or the Kotel, which is actually where I found those pictures. And let's take a look at the Old City within the Western Wall. So there are lots of subdivisions. We went from Israel to Jerusalem to the Western Wall to the Old City. Now let's open up this particular planet of pictures. And soon you will find that this planet or globe of pictures will be filled with many pictures of the Kotel in the city of Jerusalem. And you could move the globe to the right 
or you can move the globe to the left. If you like, you can move the globe up, and you can also move the globe down. And all you have to do is find a picture that you like. All right, let's say you like this picture. You click on it, and it'll indicate women at the wall. If you want to close it, you click there. You click on it again, and it will take you to a Flickr page, and it will say that this picture was given or made or taken by Allison Ride. Let's click the Flickr page now. So here we are. We have the picture created by Allison Ride. And let's see if we are able to use the picture and place it in our gallery of pictures. All you do is you click on the screen and you click once again. Let me do that again. You right click and it says this photo is copywritten. So this means I cannot use it. So what we need to do is find a picture that we can use and can include, which has a creative copy license. Well, I happen to actually find such a picture. Let me show it to you. It was found, again, through going from Israel to Jerusalem to the Western Wall to the Old City and then actually to Palestine. And I found this picture that has a creative copy license, which means I can use it. So let's click on it. And let's click on it again to get to the Flickr page. Let's go to the Flickr page now. I'm clicking here. And you'll notice that it says this photo has some rights are reserved, but I can actually use this for purposes of uh, placing it in a gallery of pictures. And I don't need the picture taker's permission to use it. All right, so that's good. Now let's show you how I would add this to my gallery of pictures. You see where on this menu it says Actions? I'm clicking on Actions and I click on Add to a Gallery. Let's click on that. And all I do is I click on the gallery that I already created, tag Galaxy Gallery of Pictures. And if I have a check, which I do, and then I click Done, you will see that if I get to this menu where it says You, not the menu that says Action, but the menu that says You, and we go down to My Galleries, we will see that I have now four photos. Remember before I had three photos? This photo of uh, Jewish men davening at the Kotel. I had this aerial view of the Kotel. I had this observant Jewish silhouetted man walking. And we just added this lovely picture of women praying at the Kotel. So, what have we said? What we have said is Tax Gallery is a website, a web tool, that enables you to organize, search, and collect pictures that are on your Flickr account and you can ultimately share them with folks by sending it through an email or particularly sharing the uh, URL of your Flickr account. Thank you very much. I hope this was helpful.